I believe my baptism saves me. I believe your baptism saves you because there we find Christ. We have a shared experience with him. Just as he was baptized, so too were we baptized in water and the word. We meet Jesus in that water. In his baptism, he comes into that water, into the, our waters of baptism to meet us there. And as he comes into the water, he comes as he is perfect, holy, righteous, just, pure, just as God is. Pure, perfect, white. And he comes there to find us. We come as sinners. Unholy, unrighteous, guilty, defiled by original sin, defiled by our actual sin that we have done and committed, that we have failed to do. We are pure sin, pure black, unrighteous and unholy. And there in those waters of baptism, the two meet and mingle. Our sin and our death is washed away and it is put upon him. Our garments that were pure black become pure white, and his white garment becomes black with our sin. So that he leaves the waters of holy baptism, goes off into the desert, into the wilderness, where de the devil is. He carries our sins out of his baptismal waters. He carries our sins as he goes to the cross to die for them with them, to bury them in the grave so that they would be no more. Now we, when we leave the waters of holy baptism, we leave clothed with Christ. That is probably why many times when you see baptisms, you might see the person who is being baptized dressed in white. It's part of our baptismal rite and liturgy uh, in our church that you have been clothed in the righteousness of Christ. You have put on Christ is what the scriptures say. Almost like a Halloween costume. That if you were to dress up as a ghost and to place a white sheet over your head and go and knock at someone's door and they would open the door and look at you, they would see a ghost dressed in white. They would not see the person underneath, the see the person behind it. But see, they would see the ghost. When God the Father looks at you, he sees Christ. He sees the righteousness and the perfection and the holiness and the obedience of Jesus, and he acts upon you as he acts upon Jesus. You are my beloved child. Come into my kingdom. We are dressed, swapped with the righteousness of Christ as he takes away our sin, that we would be brought into his kingdom. In the name of Jesus, amen.